the cues and put them together. Um, so if I do, for example, I'm going to do down, touch, down, bug down, yes, and treat, touch, yes, treat, bug down, yes, treat. And then I'm going to do a little reset. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take the cues and I'm going to change them up. I'm going to put either three or four together and I'm going to vary what order I do them. If my dog does not do the behavior the first time I cue them to, I can step in with a hand signal. Down, yes, treat, sit, yes, treat, touch, yes. Just for funsies, touch, yes. Go get it, I'm gonna reset treat, toss it off, give her a break. If she did not respond to the verbal cue the first time I asked her to, I would use the hand signal to get her back into position. And the other thing is, what I'm gonna to try to do is if things were going really well, bug down, yes, touch, yes, sit. Ooh, kind of cheated, she anticipated, and I didn't even catch that because she tends to um, go get it, touch from the sit position, but it's not a big deal. But what you saw there was me trying to get a little bit more behavior. I'm actually trying to get the three or four cues all at once before she gets the reward. <laughs> And I just lost her out the backyard to a squirrel. I'm not super worried about that. I was not looking for perfect attention. And she came back. Because she wants to play some more. Thanks for coming back, kid. I appreciate that. I do appreciate that. So one more time. Bug sit. Yes. Touch. Yes. Bug down. Yes. Sit. Yes. Good girl. Get it. That was awesome. So keep in mind, chain three or four of the cues to better, together, vary which cues you're using. If you say the cue once and your dog doesn't do it, feel free to use the hand signal. But if you think it's going brilliantly as you practice a couple of different times, I want you to start chaining three or four cues together and then um, rewarding only after the third or fourth cue. If you lose speed, if your dog starts to look confused, let it go. Don't worry about it. Go back to keeping it simple. Help them out in between each verbal cue and reward. Get that behavior going before you ask to um, ask more of your dog, right? We want to make sure we're doing a good job teaching before we upgrade you to third grade and fourth.